Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Forever Mrs. M. Thank you very much for stopping by if you're new and I really hope you stay. If you're an oldie but a goodie, thank you very much for your continued support. In today's video guys, it's a very, very exciting video that I want, I'm filming for you guys. This video is actually sponsored by Zil Seal Skincare. I hope I'm not butchering the name, but it should be Zil C Skincare. Now Zil C Skincare is actually an online a brand but well, they sent me two products to try out for you guys and I'm very very excited to try them out so I started off with my makeup on because typically I mask after I put on my makeup I don't wear makeup on the daily but whenever I do makeup I wear makeup I tend to mask my skin afterwards so I'm very very excited to be trying out these two products guys I couldn't wait yesterday <laughs> I couldn't wait to film so I opened it up just to see but I haven't literally opened up the actual products but I just just opened up to see what it comes like so basically they do ship to Zimbabwe the only thing that I had to pay was 800 bond for collection fee through the post office the products arrive through the post office for those who may want to purchase the products after I share with you guys my experience and how it works and if it works out for us uh, to buy the products these guys are on Amazon and I'll put down the Amazon link on the screen and down in the description box that you guys do check them out and I also share the individual prices of each product so that you guys do check them out as well so yeah the first thing that i got is the zil c turmeric vitamin c clay mask this is what it looks like it's basically like that that's what the box looks like so it just says that it's a turmeric vitamin c clay mask with squalene and aloe vera and it's for all skin types you guys know that i have very sensitive skin so this might be a make or break moment <laughs> this may my skin may love it or my skin may hate it but i'm going to give you guys a very very honest review i'm going to put it on for you guys uh here on the screen so that you guys see i really love the packaging of this it's it just it's just cute right it 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 it, it it's typically what you would find in your Korean packaging. If you guys watch a lot of Korean or Chinese TikToks, you guys will definitely know what I'm talking about when it comes to their packaging. So yeah, they do ship to Zimbabwe and the only thing that I paid in terms of shipping was the 800 bond, which is like a uh, dollar fifty USD uh, to get the product. When you open up the first product, it comes with this Zilsi Cone Jack Facial Puff. And this is basically what you use to, to remove the clay mask off your face. And it says that the sponge is only meant for external use on your skin that is not broken or irritated. Discontinue if irritation occurs. Keep out of reach of children. For best results, uh, be sure to replace your natural sponge every two to three months. So I don't know where I'll get another one, but yeah, that's the first product. And then the second product is actually the turmeric vitamin C clay mask. Why I was open to trying this because it has turmeric and turmeric is like it's like great right from everything that i've seen on social media turmeric is very great so that's why i wanted to try this so this is what it looks like it just says vitamin c uh, turmeric turmeric vitamin c clay masks and like what i was saying guys typically my skin doesn't like clay masks i always break out to clay masks so it'll be interesting to see Ooh, guys this pro the oh my god this feels so luxe like so right like when you open it and it has like this bouncy material i don't know how i'm going to open it. i don't want to break that okay and then it comes with this i think it's a spatula uh for when you want to oh yeah you're actually supposed to pull that to open it ah oh so it's like you pull it oh doesn't have a smell literally doesn't have a smell at all so yeah this is like the thing that was the i was worried about breaking it but you're actually supposed to break it because that's kind of like the seal but yeah it has like an orangey uh i'm the one who did this because i don't want to lose any product that's why there's product on the edges so it has like an orangey um color and literally no scent that went on my lip and literally there's no scent in there so i'm just going to close it up so this is what the first product looks like and this expires 2025 and then i'm going to open up wait there's something else in here so the next thing is actually um what's this okay this is what the oh it's the little brush like that you apply the mask with so i guess after you're done you just wash it and then you put it back so yeah 
that's the first part and then I'm going to move on to the second part which is the which is the oops the second part which is the eye cream so the eye cream is an anti-aging eye cream this is the first eye cream I'm ever going to use in my life so a lot of skincare influencers say that eye cream is just moisturizer in a smaller tube <laughs> so we're going to see this is the first eye cream that I've ever used in my life so I'm just opening that up as you guys can see everything is tightly sealed and it has the cute and fun uh, packaging that I was talking to you guys about and here goes nothing so yeah I actually tried to watch some reviews on YouTube about ooh okay purple lux zil c this is the uh, re uh visibly reduces wrinkles puffiness and dark eyes and if you guys can see i have a lot of wrinkles i don't know if that can focus i have a lot of please focus i have a lot of wrinkles uh under my eyes i have like my eyes are wrinkly so we'll see how this works so i'm um, just going to open it up oh ooh, okay Ooh, I'm not literally putting okay now let me go wash my face honestly let me go wash my face and then we can put this on I'm using my normal skincare that you guys always see me using my Porsche M skincare and then we'll move on into using these two products and god help if I break out then we'll see if I don't then yay if my skin actually feels better after this then this is a win and I'll be definitely purchasing this all the time so yeah um, let me go wash my face and then I'll come back and then we can apply the mask together hey guys So I just finished washing my face and this is what my face looks like I have that one spot and another spot Here at the moment. This is because I touched I messed around with my skin But yeah, this is what my skin is looking like. It's basically clear. This side is very much clear I just have like I said those two blemishes on this side. They're flat, but they're just like blemishes so um I'm going to take the mask. I'm just looking back so that I can take it. And this is the brush that you use. I don't know if I'm supposed to use the spatula to get it out and then put it on my hand. I think let me do that so that it's not messy. So I'm going to use the spatula to get it out. Like I just went in and did that. And then I'm going to put it on my hand. I don't know if I don't know if this is what you're supposed to do, but this is what I'm doing. And then I'm now taking the brush with the product on my hand. And then I'm just going to go in. Uh, I don't feel any tingly. Is it ting tingleness? Is there such a word as tingleness? I'm not feeling tingly or any any abnormal feeling, which is good. Because obviously, you always because I have extremely sensitive skin, so I'm always worried about how my skin will react. I hope it's not too drying because it says pore tightening and my skin has been so dry lately my skin has changed to dry sensitive it used to be sensitive oily now it's sensitive to dry i don't even know maybe it's to the skincare i really this this line i went to the rural area so i got a sunburn so that's what that line is about so we're going to apply that on all my face I hope I'm covering my whole face properly because I know a lot of people when they're trying out skincare they actually don't put it on their skin they pretend that they're putting it on their skin which is very bad especially because people a lot of people get influenced by uh, a lot of people get influenced by influencers so imagine if I was lying and not actually applying it on my skin and not showing you guys and then you guys believe me and trust me and then you go buy the product yet I haven't actually used it I'm actually going to post for some thumbnails for the video and then uh, we're going to see we're going to sit the 15 minutes let me actually take my phone and set my timer sorry where is my phone I, I was literally holding my phone right now I don't know where I put my phone anymore oh yeah found it okay so I'm going to set my timer for 15 minutes and then we're going to wait I'm um, going to my clock and then a timer <clears throat> and then we're going to put minutes we're going to choose 15 minutes right there see uh, that's 15 minutes and then we're going to press start and then we're just going to wait and then I'll take some thumbnails whilst I wait so let me go take some thumbnails and I'll come back okay guys I'm literally left with 40 seconds and we can talk about how I'm feeling and how what my skin is feeling whilst the last 30 
three seconds go ahead as you guys can see um yeah i did 15 minutes you guys can see that big round it shows that i actually did 15 minutes so my skin is feeling it's not feeling tight or dry dry it's feeling it's feeling very tacky like you not know, like what you do when you put on a primer and it feels very very tacky that's how my skin is feeling it's feeling very 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 tacky like it's not tight you no know, like the typical um like the typical clay masks this feels so different like my time my time is up let me just yeah it feels very very different it doesn't feel tight it just feels it just feels uh, tacky like i said that's the only thing i didn't tingle i didn't itch at all which is something that i really like so now i'm going to go in the bathroom and take off the marks mask and then i'll do the rest of my skincare no actually i need to tell you how my skin is feeling first after taking off the mask and then i'll do the rest of my skincare and then we'll use the uh we'll use the what's it called we'll then use the we we'll use the eye cream so let me go wash my face with this puffer and then i'll tell you guys how everything felt but basically guys it's not can you guys see that um can you please focus camera yeah you guys can see that it's not tight as you guys can see it's not tight it's not pulling if you actually do this like the product is actually moving around so it's it doesn't dry down to like a harsh yeah it doesn't dry down to a harsh finish so let me unbox this it just says that after i'm done i'm supposed to wash it and then like dry it and then i'll wait for next time like when i actually did my makeup today my skin was a bit scaling so i guess this will also help with exfoliation i have the i have the uh the safeway brush but i don't use it much anymore so let me go wash my face and then I'll okay guys i'm obsessed with this sponge <laughs> i'm obsessed with this sponge guys like it's the softest thing yo when you open it up it's so dry like it's so tough and then when you put water in, it just becomes squishy and like jelly it literally guys imagine this feeling like a gel just imagine this feeling like a gel this feels so jelly let me actually take another photo for my thumbnail i'm also working on my thumbnail as i'm working on this video because i also want the thumbnail to be pretty cool so let me do this i kid you not this is so it's actually some cool quite nice photos for my thumbnail this is so jelly oh my gosh this is so jelly i so love this so we're going to go ahead and try that. oh how my skin feels like a baby's bum you guys this mask is so softening it feels like a please mask work please work because i love you so far like this is the best clay mask i've ever used it's so luxe and like my skin feels like a baby's bum okay let's go in with the eye cream I don't I don't put anything here anyways like when I'm moisturizing I don't like to go close to my eyes so I guess I can do the rest of my skincare after I'm done so I'm going to pull it out yeah maybe we need another photo moment for this so let me just pause for a second for the thumbnail yep okay it doesn't have a scent as well um, I'm not going to be the one who does this I'm going to actually use my hands like i told you guys this is the first eye cream i've ever used in my life zil c was the one to do it this is the first ever eye cream i've ever used i've never used an eye cream in my life so this is the first one and the claims of the eye cream are that um it visibly reduces wrinkles puffiness and dark circles i can't really say i have dark circles they've never really bothered me but what i like is that this is an anti-aging cream guys if i try this out i'm going to be using i'm going to be, i've been you i've been washing my face once a day so i might have to wash my face twice a day for at least a week to see how i like how i like this but i think i can still put the eye cream during the day so i'm going to be using this eye cream every day and then but for this video guys i'm going to come and tell you how i feel about these products in the morning right now it's actually um it's actually 16 44 p.m so when i'm doing my evening skincare routine and then uh i'm going to tell you guys how i feel in the morning but yeah this is uh it feels very soft is it cooling i can't feel any cooling any cooling effect but i can't um i can't feel any tingling any discomfort there's no scent and that is very perfect for people with sensitive skin 
so yeah let me go do the rest of my skincare and then i'll catch you i'll catch up with you guys tomorrow morning and then i'll show you how uh, the Zil C clay mask and eye cream reacted in conjunction with working with my ordinary skincare. As you guys know, I love the Garnier uh, face mask, but if this one beats the Garnier face mask, I'm sorry, Garnier, you're going to be, have to put on the side. That's just how it is. I'm not going to hold you to it. I'm just going to choose the product that works better for my skin. But the the Garnier uh, mask, that one is very drying. So. Typically, uh, maybe that's why I'm having a lot of dry spots, especially because we're getting into winter. It's very drying, but it will clear your skin. That's why it has been my holy grail to keep my acne at bay together with my Porsche M. But I can use the two of them together interchangeably. But if this works, oh my gosh, if this works, I'm going to ask Zilsi to send me a backup and we can work on another video. So yeah, this is um, this is my skin. So I'll catch up with you guys tomorrow morning and we'll see how my skin is doing. Hey guys, it's the next morning after I've used my Zilsi uh, clay mask that has turmeric and yeah, this is what my skin is looking like. I actually undid my braids as well and that's my daughter in the background. I actually undid my braids last night and I wanted to come as and show you guys how how my skin was looking and my how my skin was feeling so my skin feels so supple and so soft like literally everywhere it just feels so soft and i still have the same two spots that i had yesterday i don't know why i was picking this one this morning but yeah i still have the same two spots that i had no additional spots and my skin feels extremely soft guys i actually want to read some some of the claims that i actually forgot to read to you yesterday about what this mask does for your skin so this mask actually reduces acne it evens your skin tone it retains moisture it removes excess oil and it's also vegan friendly so yeah guys I really really enjoy this mask you guys saw me I was so scared I went through the 15 minutes and I was literally dying inside that I didn't want to ruin my skin but my skin literally had no effects like you guys can see except this one I was picking it literally like five minutes ago like I was picking it subconsciously but I really really enjoy this mask I'll be using it again and for those who follow my vlogs you guys will be seeing me continuing to use this mask like um, a lot of times so yeah thank you very much to Zilsi for sponsoring this video I really enjoyed their eye cream and their mask but definitely their mask was my favorite thing out of everything out of the two products that I had and you guys I'll insert some photos of the difference between this clay mask and the traditional clay mask so that you guys see the difference because I told you guys my skin wasn't feeling dry it was just feeling tacky which I really enjoyed because typically traditional clay masks break me out like the Zillic um, clay mask ended up breaking out breaking me out literally the morning after but this I really really love I don't know if you can use it every day but I wouldn't mind <laughs> using it again today but yeah thank you very much to Zilsi for sponsoring this video and thank you very much guys for watching this video i really hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like comment subscribe hit the post notification bell right down below so that you're notified each and every time mrs m uploads a new video and yeah thank you guys very much and i'll see you in my next one bye